to YouTube, Mrs. LaWanda D coming back. I just wanted to show you guys an update on my hair. I flat ironed it. <laughs> I was going to do some almost mini twists because uh, I felt like my hair was finally long enough to do some mini twists that wouldn't look like this <laughs> out of my head. Because <laughs> my mini twists don't hang like this. They go like that. <laughs> <laughs> or any twist, so I don't wear twists, and I would love to. But when it came time to do such a with a lengthy hours on days on weeks task, <laughs> I know myself I wouldn't keep them in my hair that long, so it wouldn't equal the time put in um, working on it for a, day, a couple of two or three days would not be worth it for me since um, I would likely only have them in for a week and a half. Because that seems to be as long as I can handle any hairdo. So if I'm going to spend two or three days on a hairstyle, it need to last like a, at least two weeks or a month or something. I haven't gotten that yet because my head is... I'm not tender-headed until it's time to put a braid or a style or something in it that, that stretches my scalp. That's when I have problems. But anywho, I uh, just wanted to show you my hair uh, flat ironed. Uh, I had been watching some videos, uh, one particular vi uh, person, I can't remember her channel, but, uh, if I do, I'll put it up, um, but I hadn't subscribed to her because she doesn't use a lot, put a lot of videos up, and I remember her for whatever reason and went back to her channel, and she had been posting, her hair is super long, and so, um, I decided to look at some of her videos and she showed one of her straightening her hair and she was asking for help on advice as to what to do about when you flat iron your hair. Uh, her hair reverted, reverts, reverts back, excuse me. When she starts on the back, by the time she gets to the front, her hair in the back has reverted back ridiculously and shrunken and she was saying it wasn't really worth it to put all that time into her hair if it's going to be poof. Well, the thing about, so I kept that in mind when I um, went to do my hair. And that, I don't know what this is, faux, faux C, something, I don't know. I think it'll become faux B later. <laughs> I have no idea. All I know is this stuff is a mess to deal with. And so I went into this with the full knowledge that there was a 99% chance that my hair would revert back like that to uh, YouTuber hair did and so I started out and I'm telling you um the flat iron I have I'll show you my flat iron this was like ridiculous like twenty dollars off at the time I just happened to need a flat iron for my daughter's hair who by the way baby girl got all her hair cut off and it was down here if you've been trying to keep track of her hair and what I'm doing with hers she just didn't want to do nothing with it, and she just didn't care, so I didn't either and cut it all back off, so it's back to short, short again. But um, I bought this Bear Nano um, flat iron for her thick um, hair, and like I said, it was like 20 it, but I think 20 to $25 off at Sally's when I walked in, and I was standing there deliberating on that thing. And I was like, do I really want to spend that much money? Even though it was 20 something dollars off, it was still kind of high for me because I haven't bought hair stuff for years and years and years. My stuff lasts like forever. <laughs> so, um, you know, don't curl the knives from the 80s that don't have a temperature gauge. So you just, it's like cold or lava hot. <laughs> so I bought the Jer Bear. It's the Jer Bear de Paris Nano Ceramic Silver. So. If you want to buy that, um, that's what it is. And it was like, I think them things like $80 and I got it for 55 or something crazy like that. So I ended up saying I lost my mind if I leave this store and don't get it. And then when I saw somebody else walk in and it was one left, I, sn <laughs> I snatched it up. But anyway, <clears throat> so getting off right. But I, I started on over here and um, the hair was slightly soft, but then I got to the back and oh, this hair in the back right here, I don't know what it is, it's like to detangle it, all I have to do is just run my fingers through it, it doesn't really tangle, it's like not like the rest. And the curl pattern is different, I don't really have a curl pattern, but it's different, it's different like non-curl pattern. <laughs> it's soft and I love it. 
So um, that was soft, and then it did, by the time I worked my way up, it wasn't so soft. It wasn't like the silky lusciousness that it started out to be. Now, it is not a big deal that my hair did revert back in some fashion or form. Let me turn around so you can see it. Okay, so it wasn't any big deal that it reverted back slightly to, to, to me. So because I went natural, because I just want my hair natural, I don't care about having bone straight hair. Um, I know a lot of naturals, they wash it, do whatever, condition it, and they straighten it or flat iron it, and that's how they keep their hair always. I have a friend that her hair is always flat iron. I've never seen it completely natural without any manipulation of any heat. And so that's fine for them. I have no opinion on that. You know, you don't get to do your head. So what? Do I, what is my point in saying anything? I could care less. <laughs> Cause everybody has to. You got to deal with that stuff. So, but for me, I tried to go natural in the past. The hair was so thick. I didn't have knowledge or you know any kind of information on how to take care of my hair in its natural state. And it is so thick that I spent all my time for, uh, straightening with the straightening comb and the pressing oil and all that madness and I'm sweating it out as I'm doing it because it's like a thousand degrees by that oven. So um, my point in going natural was to just leave it in its natural state. So knowing that it will revert back did not matter to me because I, I don't care if my hair is bone straight. I don't, I've gone through that with the having my hair relaxed and if I wanted bone straight hair honestly for me I just would have kept the relaxer because I know this stuff was mm -mm, it's not gonna do that it's not <laughs> so um this is the hair flat iron and I put a little hairspray in it I never throw stuff away and this is why because you never know when you're gonna use it again if I just said I'm going natural and threw away all products related to relaxed hair I would be looking crazy so my hair will fall in this Florida humidity because it's like 900 degrees outside and it's eight, it's eight something and I guarantee you when I walk out there I might need my inhaler because it'll be like you could cut the air with a knife so um and it's only May but um but getting back on track so I can get off of here because I got to go to the store is I love it it's it's still soft um even though it reverted, it's still combable. You see, I can run my hair completely. Oh, it feels so good. Um, but all I did was, you know, flat iron it, and then I just bumped my ends under. This is the style I've worn for years. <laughs> so it's like my brain was just itching to get the hair back in the style that I always kept it in. I don't know why, but this is the hairstyle I went back to. And so I am so happy with how my hair turned out. Um, and I'm happy with um my how much hair it is you know that was one reason why i want to flat iron i want to really just see what five inches looks like and 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 it's cute i love it you know do, do you like it <laughs> let me know it's not as short as i thought it would be um because it's so shrunken in its natural state it's just like this long <laughs> the shrinkage is ridiculous but anywho um this my head flat iron um, I keep it like this for as long as it'll let me. <laughs> if all I have to do is brush it, that's, that's all good. I don't even care. As long as I can comb it, I don't have to like detangle and all that and twist and madness. No. That's my problem. Bedtime. Because this hair has to be twisted. every. I cannot wear no twist out for no, like two days and then I have to... It's crazy. It's not comfortable after two days. So this is a bit like a relief from me. And not having to wear wigs because that requires me to braid my hair, which I don't like. So, um, I'm liking it. Hope it lasts. Not too shabby. At least, not for me. Lawanda out. Bye.